Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's been a long time and for that I apologize. Today I'm downtown in Gauchon, as you can see, and we're going to be shooting with the GR3 using the new color profile, the color negative. It's part of the 1.7 firmware upgrade. If you didn't do it yet, check it out. The link's in the description. Anyway, let's get started. Okay guys, this is the um, website for downloading the firmware version uh, for 1.7. 1.70 you see that they've added the negative film to the image control they've also done something where you can turn the power off remotely from the image sync hmm I would never do that but anyway so yeah you just go to this website scroll to the bottom and then you can download download here for Windows or Mac and the updating procedure is is here I'll leave a link to this in the description take a shot of the 85 tower this used to be the uh, the tallest building in Taiwan before Taipei 101 I've included some of the tree above there to kind of make a better composition than just having sky there's some nice reflections in the building there Gaosheng Reading Festival and then we have the reflection of the 85 tower behind me. I'm actually shooting in aperture priority mode today. Um, set to f6.3 with the auto ISO set to a minimum shutter speed of 320th. They have a lot of things that you can't do here. Now these these colors are quite quite subdued compared to the positive simulation. Uh, this is very. These flowers are very vibrant, but in the what I'm seeing on the back of the screen, it's it's not. It's very it's very subdued. It's very strange for me to shoot in color. You know, I'm, if you see my videos, a lot of the stuff is in black and white. I prefer black and white. So today is quite interesting to see the difference in the images. I may throw in a, snoo, a few sneaky black and white comparisons. Got it. Did I get it? <laughs> like I like the how the uh, the weather's beaten the the reflective sticker on here. And also on the floor here we have a we have a hole of light. The hole of light. See it? for the baby food academy looks like it's eating a slug <laughs> I don't really like to work with images directly out of the camera I rarely shoot in raw plus JPEG I prefer just to shoot raw I find the JPEGs are like a, a clutter <laughs> I just like to shoot raw and then actually work on the few images that I choose to uh, I don't want to have all those images everywhere so these images here are a result of the shoot today I, I went out and just picked a few out and just edited them because I wanted these to be more um, interesting than the basic ones straight out of the camera Guys, thank you very much for watching the video. If you made it to the end, and uh, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. 
I'll try not to make it so long next time. Bye-bye.